hello everybody good morning or it's well, probably it's close to afternoon even for me I mean, i'm in a pretty early time zone compared to other people so good afternoon probably to you um this is not a scheduled stream or anything i'm just sitting here playing archvale uh so i figured i may as well stream some i don't know how long i'll go Uh, I unlocked the dungeon in this cave area, but I still have a lot to explore here, and I feel like I'm at a good power level, maybe even a little overpowered for this area, so may as well give it the full exploration here, you know? Although I'm going to have to find something to spend money on here pretty soon, because my bank is pretty close to full. Or no, I just got a bank expansion. It's like the file like 5,000 I can get now. And I think I'm at 3,000, so get it. Let's go. And I'm playing like shit. My volume too low now. Room. Uh, 15. Ooh, that's tempting. I do like that I'm getting so much extra gold from enemies from the one I have on. Definitely very greedy, but maybe for a boss or whatever, I would switch to the defense one. <laughs> do a little loop de loop. Do the loop, the loop, and pull. Shooters are looking cool. SpongeBob, everybody. Give me money. That I don't really need right now. I'm mostly stockpiling money because I know that I'm like on the cusp of really needing to get a new weapon. This one's been at plus five for a while, and it's served me very well. But uh, it's getting to the point where. It's not doing enough damage, especially in, like, the ocean and jungle biomes. Uh, and upgrading good weapons is very expensive. Alright, let's we'll see how rough this is. I had a few really rough ones early on, but the last several I've done have not been too bad. This one seems pretty bad. Gotta stop dodging down there. Okay, it seems like this is actually a pretty consistent pattern, though. I can just kind of go in a big circle here. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Easy enough. Oh, now there's two of them. Oh, that was dangerous. Play a dangerous game here! Damn it. Son of a bitch. Ah. when I get stuck on the second tier because it's like, wow, they're just going to make this harder in a second and it's going to be much worse. Well, there was one where I was stuck on the second tier for a long time and then the third tier was super easy. Very confusing.
Okay, they're seeing shooting in unison now, I see. I see. Oh crap. She's going pretty well there. Am I not I'm not taking damage from this one, that's weird. Usually I take like one point of damage at a time, I think. I deserve that. Tricky moves, but they didn't pay off. Ash hand. Definitely not one of those cases where the third one ends up being easier somehow. Oh, dang it. Damn it. Damn it. Can't even dash through like a full ring. Yeah, I can. Just keep dashing into a second ring. That's the problem. Oh my god. That was fancy. I thought it was already done, so I wasn't even focusing on the fact that I was alive. Oh crap. Post in all the discords and stuff, one sec. Yes. And a defense buff for every protection her owned. It's actually kind of nice, but 
I don't have any protection hearts <clears throat> on right now from anything, so. Fuck it. I've half the badges now, though, apparently. That's nice. I really flubbed it on that archer at the end, but that's fine. <laughs> Just throwing bombs into holes, you dumbass. Last two here, then I'll head back, deposit my money. Some fucking damage there. Where'd you come from, buddy? It's been standing down there. I got a lot of badges I can buy. Many of which are very expensive, so it'll be fine. Let's wait until the bank is actually full. I do believe I only needed one of those for my next health upgrade, or healing upgrade, I should say. So I will gladly take them.
much damage. Get a lot of damage there for no reason. That wasn't that much though. I've got a lot of defense. Oh, I jumped in a hole. Awesome. Yeah, it looks like there's something at the end of this dead end. I've had a lot of dead ends in this game that's just like, well, there's nothing here. I don't know why this is a dead end. I, I wonder if the map's like randomly generated or something. I guess I could find out pretty easily by starting a new game. Although even then it might not be the tiles that are randomly generated, but just the uh like things where things are. I've also had situations where I run into like two save statues right in a row, which doesn't seem right. forget that I had my bomb because it was incredibly useless when I got hit. It's a little more useful now but still not very useful. There's just some badges I've gotten for it so presumably you can make a build around it but I don't know. That's worthwhile. I love zones like this with a bunch of little piddly trash enemies now that I have the I mean I love them in general because it's just fun to kill a lot of things really fast but especially now that I have the heal when you kill an enemy badge just a bunch of extra free healing not even really using potions that much in this zone I don't really need to despite eating quite a lot of damage uh, I will go ahead and use a potion now then Gosh dang it. Pinched to catch a lot of freaking orbs from that blue mage, Jesus. Yeah, there's something in this dead end too. Love that. Another statue. Take the extra defense. Gladly. I guess this is the fastest way to go back. Probably should have went back to uh, base. I got almost 2,000 gold on me. It looks like a dungeon, but there's no arch stone in it, so I don't know what's up with that. Nor do I want to know. I will figure it out. end with something in it. This feels more designed than the last several zones I've explored. Which is good. Hello. Ooh, black rod. 
Oh, I just realized I've been getting a ton of these dark wizard stabs. Staves. Like, do I have to at least experiment with every new weapon I get? 138. It's got a very high range, I guess. Oh, and it bounced around. That's kind of cool. Experimented with a wand early on. It's not a huge fan of the one I had. And I, like, every time I get a new one, I, you know, do that, grab it, and I use it for a bit and say, hmm, this seems fine. I've got a couple of these cannons that seem really good, but then they just, like, don't do a lot of damage. Like, it says 240, but I think you have to hit them with every shot, all three of the shots to get 240. Which requires a lot of luck and getting a lot closer than just hitting them with a good melee weapon like what I have right now. Okay, let's grab this real quick, though, before we use it. Grab this empty room. Let's go up to that castle. Nearly fully explored the caves here. Uh, oh well, first let's head back. Actually head back to the main town because I've got enough plums to upgrade my uh, healing. And I think I even had one extra. So now I probably need five for the next upgrade. Oh, just four more. Excellent. My god, just seeing all the freaking when you scroll like way down on the map, it's like, look at all these fast travels that are over there. Funny. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I need to spend money. I have treasures I can sell him too. I guess I may as well. Let's deposit and then let's spend what I still have on me. It's 2,500. Uh, I don't think there's anything I want from her. She's got like weapons and stuff that I don't think I have, but I also don't think I want. I'm just gonna end up depositing them anyway. Uh, like that one. Like that one. Temporary damage buff, sure. Yeah. Got almost all of his badges. I'm kind of running out of stuff to buy right now. Whoops. I mean to re teleport to exactly where I am. Believe it or not. What's this? Stone? Probably Onyx Reading is better. Just the extra defense over the. Ice shield, although I do evade enemy damage a lot. I'm not exactly sure how that one works. So. Max speed plus 12%. Keep that on me too. Here, why not? Didn't even see him. Right in my face. A 
drop the enemies give me more gold accessory at this point, considering I have next to nothing to spend gold on at the moment, and my freaking bank is full. Or bomb upgrade, why not? Uh -huh. Statues broke. Yeah, this must be like the final dungeon. I have three out of seven stones, so that would make sense to me. It's annoying that they just have the fairy fountain broken. Like, um, let me just fast travel back here without going through some already pretty easy enemies that are only going to become easier. Alright, let's go do the dungeon in this area. So I am kind of tempted to attempt the ocean a little bit, to try and get to the town at least, and expand my bank. Should we do that? Yeah, let's do that. <clears throat> Even though the ocean hasn't been very rough. The only thing I've really changed is that I have the these two on. Enemies provide- defeating enemies provides minor healing and all restoration is stronger. Just gives me more survivability, you know, but still not killing these enemies very fast at all. I might even argue I'm killing these enemies incredibly slowly. Right up this town. So much damage. Heal. Tell my damage is not good enough to be here by how long it takes me to break a freaking ore resource thing. And if there's a boss that prevents me from getting into the town, there's no way I'm gonna be able to beat that. healing is definitely doing me some big favors in terms of just getting through here. I can get to town. Again, as long as there's no boss. Which, considering the town has two entrances, I don't think there's gonna be a boss, because they can't block both entrances. Same boss, you know. Oh, I'm playing like shit in here. Got to loot a bunch of gold. Why is my dash through enemies to lower their defense thing not working? Did I take that off? I don't think so. No. Because the enemies are ish, so they're technically floating or something? I don't understand. That's bad. Ah, oh, he does so many in a row. Yeah, suddenly my dash through enemies to lower their defense badge is not working. Maybe I need to take it off and put it back on. Maybe it's some kind of weird bug. Boy, I'm doing much worse in the second uh, second part of this. Um, just gonna see if that works. So I really like being able to dash through enemies to lower the defense. It's very useful. It doesn't work in this water biome for some reason. Yes, is what's happening. Oh, 
I guess I need to just stop even caring about trying to dash away. Oh my god. They're enemies. Heal! No! One screen away. Then I greeted for a heal. Unwise. My god. The screen is going poorly. Oh my gosh, I ran right into that. What is happening? What is happening? Just wasted like 1500 gold between those two deaths, something like that. But again, I really don't have anything to spend gold on right now, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Son of a bitch. This screen sucks. Just a random projectile deals 20 damage to me. I need to find more fairy fountains for more defenses, honestly. What I'm gonna do for now is equip this defense ring. Help. A little bit, probably. It's going much worse than last time I got to this point. And even 15 defense doesn't do that much. And that's 15 freaking uh, fountains worth of defense. I have like a ridiculously good armor set. The, I don't remember which one. Well, either the temple helmet or chest plate, I know Tyler used all the way through the end of the game. So like, it's a, it's a good armor set. Alright, let's use my last potion. Try to survive through this last stretch here. Oh my god, it's immediately just a disaster. Hate all of you, I hate all of you so much. Please die. Son of a bitch. fish win court cases. They are always guilty. Oh, your dad's funny. I would like an extra batch slot. Thank you. Got a bunch of new ones. Consume healing potions faster. Oh, that's kind of nice. Well, it takes three. That seems like a bit much. First damage for a short time after defeating an enemy. Increases fire rate, but significantly increases damage. Interesting. Bloodlust seems pretty good. Uh, I don't need to buy any of these right now. Uh, let's see, do you have a heart for guy? Do, yay. It's been a while since you've had one of those. What does she have new for this area? Does she have anything? Water? Merman? Trident is probably new. I don't really like spears. Another bank. Store 7,000. What are you looking at? I don't know, I'm trying to figure it out. Seriously, what are you? Human pearl lock? Inconceivable. I'll destroy your deity statue thing. Ship, you love to see it. 
very good art design and music in this game. Although this underwater music is surprisingly not that great. Not bad. Just underwater themes are usually amazing. This one's eh, it's fine. Uh, okay, we expanded our bank at least, so we should probably just go ahead up that dungeon. Although, I'm tempted to keep exploring here. There's a good flail here, Tile to t Tile Tyler told me about. Um, and I really do need a new weapon. This one's... Uh, it's getting beyond its, its point of being useful, you know. But I, it was doing well for me over in the dark cave area, so let's just go to that dungeon. And if we don't find a new weapon in here that I want to use, we're probably going to go back to the ocean and try to find that flail. Because uh, I think I should go to the jungle before the ocean. Seems like the correct order in terms of difficulty. Yeah, I do lower his defense. It just doesn't work underwater for some reason. Uh, but the jungle, I don't know, you know, what weapons I'm going to find in there. I know I already found, like, the grass cannon or whatever the hell it's called, which was not great. Bird. School area. Bunch of little fungus guys in D and D costumes. I mean, as D&D classes, I guess I should say they are actually, you know, archers and wizards and whatnot. Hey, I forgot I got a batch slot. I need to put something on there. Oh my god, I just jump in the water, why don't I? Yeah, I'm like not even taking damage here. With the amount of defense I have and the healing I'm getting. Although, oh yeah, I do still have that defense badge on. I should probably push that back to getting extra money. Gold treasure, silver treasure. <laughs> um. Right badge. Uh, I still have this extra hard on that I don't feel like I need as well. So there's a two cost one that I want. Like, increase melee damage? Let's do that. Yeah, that's a little more damage I'm taking. Still healing like crazy, though. Destroying this dungeon right now. This dungeon just a straight line. It's like a gauntlet of battles. A fun idea for one dungeon. Kind of like the Paper Mario Thousand Year Door thing where one of the... Shut up, Bard. One of the, like, uh... Zones, I don't know. One of the levels, I guess. Yeah, worlds. Is just, like, a big arena where you fight a ton of battles. And that's a super fun, like, distraction for one zone. But if every zone was that, it would be fucking awful. Lasers, thank you. Go away, Bard. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm not even having to use potions. I'm not even like trying that hard to dodge everything and everything. Yeah. upon taking damage and defense up by 10. Hmm. It's probably nicer actually than the defense plus 15 ring. Already to the boss. Love it. Curse seeps into my roots. The colony bends to his will. You wish to free him? Then you shall die. I forgot I, my healing badge is not going to do anything here. I should have taken that off and replaced it with something else. This game forsaken me. Oh, so close. I played really bad though, so I kind of deserved to die. Oh, also, I didn't even go drop off my goal, but whatever. Uh, okay, let's switch to the defense ring, or well, uh, yeah, just switch to the straight up defense ring, and then let's switch this. Well, I guess switch that badge as well. Put on. I could have gone on the faster. Oh no, wait, I didn't buy the faster potion one, right? Yeah. Kind of like explosive retreats. Super Reach doesn't work with this weapon for whatever reason. I guess because it doesn't like actually fire projectile, it's just it reaches its reach. It's a temporary damage buff. That can be okay. Fairy that reduces enemy defense. Me and a debuff. Gain a defense buff for every protection heart. I don't have any protection hearts. Man, despite having a ton of badges, I do not have that many that are useful. I guess that. that. I don't know if he's even, I don't think he even like inflicted any status ailments or whatever on me though. That's not very useful, is it? I guess if you equip that, I won't be at full health for very long, but whatever. Magic bond, enchanted, whatever. I should have dropped off my money, whatever. It's not that much money anyway. Racing this asshole. Immortality fading.
And all these later bosses give full heart containers. Pretty sure they usually give a half, right? Or maybe I'm just thinking of the sub bosses in the zones. The arch was intended to bring the people salvation from the old king's reign. When assembled, the seven stones would summon a portal to a world beyond our own. A world of eternal bliss, ethereal, intangible. A world incapable of harboring the dark magic that fueled the king's power, or so it was said. That it always sounded a foolish thought to me, yet the promise of a hidden realm beyond the arch served as a beacon of hope to those who had long suffered under the king's horrid rule. As word spread through Whisper, many undertook a great pilgrimage to the chamber of the archer's construction. Three pieces still remain. See, let's deposit what little money I have. Now let's re equip stuff I want on. Put all my resources away. So it's either to the ocean or to the jungle now. The jungle is definitely easier. I've already unlocked the dungeon there. I could even go to the dungeon, but there's still a lot of exploration to be done in the jungle. Um, but the ocean I know has a weapon that I want. Let's, let's explore the jungle a little and see how it goes, because I was definitely struggling with the jungle a bit. But maybe it'll go better. With all the healing stuff I have. better, but it's going better. Try to go back down to that question mark that I was almost at once before, where I got destroyed. Got the statue. I use one potion even. So I think we're good to explore the jungle. I would really like a stronger weapon though. This one's just not quite keeping up with where I need it. Flying enemies are super annoying. Nice to hold that in there. Mm -hmm. 
Jesus Christ. Trim's off to a terrible start here. I'm not even gonna drink a potion, actually. <clears throat> not that bad off. Oh boy, let's go. Let's try. This one's gonna be rough. Damn it! Had it that time. I fucked it up. That was messy. Come on, there we go. My God. Wow, that was pretty lucky in the middle there. So they're both firing at the same time, but a little slower. Oh, that was super easy for the third one. Although I did almost fuck it up again. Striking an enemy three times with a melee weapon and flex bleed. Oh, sounds pretty good. Uh, where is it? Time just cost to equip three, of course. I'm already inflictably damaged with this, this current weapon anyways, but... Probably not better than just straight up increased melee damage. It'll be nice to equip for bosses, I guess, when I have to take these off because they don't do anything. Yeah, I don't want to unequip any of that other stuff, though. Not a great room. That's fine. Totally fine. Damn it. Uh, drink. Statue, explore that last little dead end to the right. that teleports around.
All right. Just a little dead end. Head back to the statue and definitely head back to town. We've got a lot of money on us. And then we'll come back through this loop-de-loop -loop and dead end and everything. the 7,000, so bank's basically full. Oh, did I get up upgraded to 10,000? It may have. I think it might be 10,000 now. We'll find out. <clears throat> we'll find out. Okay. Uh, either one of these I go to, it's going to be three rooms. Well, there's only two rooms to get to the new room, so let's go do that. Best start for here, but that's fine. Potion. Oh, there it is. Nice, that was a good room actually. Despite the chaos. Probably not necessary. That's fine. Probably should have went and grabbed that one empty room before I grabbed that, but that's fine. Just gotta fight back through this room. Not a big deal. Back down, jerk. To that long weird thing over there. Oh, wait, I don't want to go in the dungeon. Not yet. Probably finish exploring the jungle, which is still quite a bit, uh, and then end the stream.
Damn, that was a terrible room. Got a double chug here. Oh, there is one of these things. I don't see it. Fuck, I hate those. It's another pretty terrible room. Hopefully this question mark is a statue. This. Oh, there's another one. Let's go down first, shorter route. Nothing down here, but fine. Still rack up some cash. We should actually go to town soon. Got a lot of money. Sapphire ring. Magic damage. Ugh, of course, I get a freaking gold legendary ring, whatever you want to call it. This for magic damage, something I don't use. Right into that little stray bullet. Still one of these jerks hanging out. There we go. Okay, let's go to the statue and go to town. See if we can deposit this money. I think we can deposit up to 10,000, so we should be able to. I hate that there's no town in the jungle. Have some like Amazons there or something, you know? I oh, know nope, seven thousand is the max. Okay. Is there a bad shop here? I think there is. It's up here. Yeah. See, I'm interested in that one. Interested in that one. That one. And just buy them all at this point. Still only have space for 900 gold there. Crazy. Really need a new weapon to upgrade. That's somewhere where my money could go for at least a while, you know? A little while. Just haven't found anything super worthwhile since I got the scythe. And it's at a point where I may as well start just increasing things to plus five and seeing how they do. I don't have anything else to do with my money and I don't want to carry around 10 billion gold or whatever. Risk losing it all. I'd rather just boost weapons up for no reason. I don't know. Both are not great options. Oh shit, I should have drunk first. Well, that's fine. It's an empty room anyway. Or not empty. It has a mega plum, but no enemies is what I mean. Could have been worse. It's a statue again already? That'd be crazy. Oh no, it's a, one of these. Looks like it might be a statue above. Nope, a bomb upgrade. Oh, and then another freaking question mark. Is that a statue? Jeez. Okay, let's go try that. Brian. This one seems pretty hard. Yep, yep, yep. Very unpredictable. This is just some classic bullet hell shit right here. Not really a lot of prediction and patterns and stuff. Okay, now they're going slow. But there's two of them. Going around more slowly, I should say. They're still rapid firing. 
This might actually be easier than the first stage was. Oh, they're firing very rapidly now. Holy shit. Very dangerous. Oh, I had to blink. <laughs> Almost fucked me. That's fine. Deal bonus damage with your next attack after dashing. Oh, that also seems really good. I dash a lot. It only takes one. Trade out the greedy coin. Not doing anything for me, honestly. So do I have to visit a statue before it changes out what badges I'm using? Probably, because it still shows the greedy coin on there. Interesting. So then that boss fight I did, the, my freaking charms probably didn't even actually switch out because I don't think I hit the statue again after I changed them. Emerald ring. Range damage, yay! statue and then I think there's one room up there yeah just hit up for no real reason okay now that's updated interesting interesting I need to go to an easier biome and test how much damage increase I'm actually getting from that Deposit my money. Well, I guess I'll sell my treasures too before I do that. Although I don't know if I'll be able to deposit all the money. Yeah, no. I'm fine. There's only one town left to find. I could potentially have new stuff to buy. Probably will have new stuff to buy, and will also expand my bank. And that's in the lava area, which I could not get to before. Or well, I guess I didn't try like chugging potions. I was just like taking the damage and letting it go. I could probably get up there. Um, right, I want this, this. Okay, so what's this damage? 252 and 52 bleed. Uh, that doesn't help unless I find another butterfly now. Oh, come on. I want enemies right now and you won't give them to me. So that's 315. Let's try. Dash. That's 475. Okay, that's a decent increase. It's like, oh, is that a 30%, 40% something like that? Okay, let's go here. Still got quite a bit of force to explore over there. Yeah, no, this is a little quicker than going to the dungeon.
How many plums do I have? Just one? Yeah. I think I need four for an upgrade. I mean, I may as well have dropped off that one while I was there, but it doesn't really matter. Shit. Drinking before I came in here. Sapphire room. Chug, chug, chug. Uh, this room's going poorly. Oh, it's so open. There's nowhere to hide. And worse, I suppose. And I'm going through potions fast. Hide behind this wall. Suckers, you're all too dumb. Oh, come on. I ran right into that. Maybe I'm the dumb one. Mm -hmm. I'm more likely to find a save if I go up or whatever, a statue, but I'm already here. Let's explore this little dead end. Oh, these rooms are just not going well for me at all. Oh, there's a question mark here. Might be a statue. It is excellent. Terrible room. Oh, there's just two rooms over here before I'm gonna be heading back to the statue anyway. Quite a bit of gold, but there's nothing to spend it on anymore other than upgrading weapons, so let's just... Well, for the time being, anyway. And I don't have any weapons that I... worth upgrading, I think. I don't think. Face a bunch of times there. Oh, not good. Oh, nice. A little heart. A little heart drop. Uh, let's go to the right. I just finished one. There's still a flower alive.
Ooh, there's a question mark down here. Could be a statue, but honestly, I'm probably good to do these little side rooms first. So I don't have to keep refighting that middle room. Decision, I'm sure, but I'm gonna hit up this room as well. Oh my god. Heal, damn it. Boy, that was, uh, that was risky. Hopefully this is a statue, because if not, I'm kind of boned. A lot of potions and quite low on health. Ah, uh, just a chest. Oh wait, it's another question mark room right after the Stinger launcher. Oh, it's a bee gun. Does it, like, summon bees when I hit them? Or is it just, hey, look at this silly weapon. That's not very good. Don't you like it? Uh, what's the shortest route back? One, two, three. Four, three, four, and it's the same either way. One, two, three, four. And it's the same no matter which way I go, it seems like. Uh, so I guess let's just go back up this way. Oh, yeah, at least this is gonna be an empty room because it was a treasure chest. Don't plan on using this thing, but. Okay, poisons, I see. It's a good room. Very dumb flower. I like having a status weapon against these flowers, because you can tell where they're going. Or, I mean, it doesn't have to be a status weapon, even just when I dash through them, I leave the defense down marker on them, which serves the same purpose. Set up and into that little alcove here. Oh boy, this room is just so open. There's so many projectiles. That went very poorly. I got a double chug here. This is this a statue? No. New melee weapon that I like? Seems fine. Sure. Is this a statue? What the hell is this? Centuries have passed since I have had a visitor. It was nice to see the face of another out in these lonely wilds. Please take this as a token of my gratitude. Ericata bow. Fires very slowly. Is it incredibly powerful? Oh, yeah, wow. 718. Jesus. It's not pierce or anything either, though. It does deal a lot of damage, though. Stupid frickin' war in the middle of the field. Screwed me up a little bit there. Got another question mark. Statue! Means I'm gonna have to go back through these handful of rooms to get back to the last couple of rooms I did not hit yet. That's fine. Yeah, like the centipede, you can't dash through to lower his defense either. It's just some enemies doesn't affect for whatever reason.
play truly is the ultimate material. For sure. Wait to grab that. Cool. Take another Mega Plum. I guess I may as well grab it right now. Then I'll hit up that last room. And then I'll probably end the stream. Sitting in this chair. I sat in this chair all day yesterday and it really hurt my booty. Uh, and I'm gonna be sitting in it for at least three hours for recording tonight, so I probably wanna give myself a little bit of a break. Go we'll sit in my living room and then I'll find something to play on the PlayStation. Um, but yeah, that's the jungle fully explored. Caves are fully explored, we only have two zones left. Let's go see if we can even get in the lava area real quick. Actually, let's first go drop off whatever gold we can. Not gonna be my oh yeah, literally I can't drop if any. The badge guy has nothing left for me. Is there anything I want to buy from her? Yes, buy one of everything I don't have. No real reason. I have Colossus Sword. Thought that thinking it might be good. It was not. That chest plate go that I just bought. Did it go to storage? Who knows? I wish there was a way to sort this. Did not go to storage. I think it just went straight into the trash. Pretty cool. Uh, let's see, we don't need the emerald or sapphire ring. Oh wait, no, I didn't want to deposit the plums. Oh really? The storage is fucking full? Oh, that sucks. So here's the problem, that means we gotta take a bunch of this shit out and start throwing it away. <clears throat> Which is fine, because I don't need it, but it's also not fine. Uh, because it's really annoying to try to throw stuff away in this game. It just takes forever. I think I have a double of them definitely gonna throw away. Like, it was clearly designed for mouse and keyboard. Like, there's not just a button to put it in the trashes. Very annoying. Dad, why camp out your storage? It's so obnoxious. Ugh, I've got multiple of these as well. Yeah, the storage was once again completely full. Or no way, there's like six slots in the middle there. It doesn't even condense itself. God, that's annoying. God forbid I ever need to find something specific in there. Well, I'll be screwed. Oh, I just dropped it on the floor of the chest play, I see. Yeah, 
Yeah, miss me with that. Thank you. How much money do we have left in the bank? After buying all that crap that we didn't need. Almost full still. Excellent. Uh, right. Let's see if we can get into the lava zone. Just for shits and giggles, really. The child wish to enter Molten Rift must pass the demon's ritual. Yep. Oh, I can't heal during this. Okay. I had plenty of that time though. The child prevails. They are much stronger than they look. The child may enter. Cool. I think this is the zone that has, I would assume, the strongest weapons. So maybe I should just explore here. Say like, fuck the ocean. Although I'm sure this zone is very hard to explore. <clears throat> uh, all right, I'm gonna end the stream there though. Thanks everybody for watching. Um, next scheduled stream is on Thursday morning. I might do a, another bonus stream before then though. Who knows? Thanks everybody. Bye.